So this is Sphere Flying Cities. Shout out to um, the publishers Assemble Entertainment and the developers Hexagon Sphere Games for letting me play this. I appreciate the code. Um, this is Early Access Part 1. Um, in 2022, the updates 3 and 4 will come. Um, early next year, the second update will come. So we just have, right now, we have institutions, industry, and pollution. The next update is going to be age and wealth. And then later on in 2022, the other uh, 3 and 2, 5 updates will be coming. Um, this is like a really cool little sci-fi game here. <laughs> Looks like there's a lot of reading and I'm going to do none of that. Okay. None of it. Let's start. A, a few, few weeks, weeks after the initial reports about the asteroid came out, it was undisputedly acknowledged in the academic world that it was going to collide with the moon. That was the day our world changed forever. Our reactions were as dark as science had predicted. Very little was spared from the destruction no one from the disbelief. The impact of the asteroid shattered the moon into pieces, completely obliterating it. A thick layer of debris engulfed the planet, blocking out the sun. Fallout, flooding, darkness. Mankind was doomed. The recent discovery of anti-gravity gave us hope. This new technology laid the foundation for the future of mankind. The development of the anti-gravity device was a colossal undertaking. Scientists, mechanics, and engineers from around the globe came together in its creation. Everyone was anxiously awaiting the startup of the device. Then, there was a malfunction. During ignition, a destructive heat wave was released from the core. The surrounding area was almost completely destroyed. The device finally stabilized at a reduced capacity. And the ascension succeeded. was fucking crazy was cinematic as hell Okay, so this is me. A death saving, sorry, finally. It's a good thing you're here. We need you to take over as commander. I know you're being thrown into the deep end, but there's no other option. Okay, first off, I need to turn down this music, because it's popping. It's popping. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's popping. <laughs> it's popping. There we go. Apply that. Say that right there. Boom, at the beginning. Okay, <clears throat> as I was saying. I know you're being thrown into the deep end, but there are no other options. Most of those who were in charge are no longer with us. It certainly isn't going to be easy, but I have no doubt that you'll do just fine and take the mantle of responsibility. That heat wave hit us so quickly, it was awful. The AG devices seem to be working for now. We made it above the dark clouds and debris. No one could have predicted this sort of catastrophe. The heat wave almost destroyed our entire infrastructure. The only thing we have working at the moment is a single power plant. If you ask me, we're lucky to be alive. I'm Jacob, by the way, the city planner. Status reports show that the most of the colonists are safe. Lucky for us, they were in a protected area of our city's ascent. However, 
some are injured and need to be cared for first. There should be hundreds of more survivors still out in the escape pods. They must be in this neighboring sectors. Those poor souls need our help. They're stranded out there and we should do whatever it takes to find them. Our satellite network is down and we can't communicate with Earth. And we haven't been receiving any distress signals from the escape pods. Basically, um, nothing works right now. We're stranded and completely on our own. We should start rebuilding with what we have as soon as possible. So right now, humanity is struggling. All right, we are struggling. This is a struggle. Okay. Okay, woo. <clears throat> okay, baby, let me see if I can do this because because this is rotate. Mm-hmm. Camera left rotate. Space to pause. Ro camera up down to page up and down. What the fuck? Oh god. Okay, you doing a lot. You doing a lot. Okay. Set up the residential units, aid centers, plantations, and hydro trees to fill and basic needs of colonists. Build power plants to produce energy to operate IG device and other production sites. Use the world map to explore other sectors and detect resources and rescue survivors. Building a mining drone hub and begin mining raw resources to gather material and discover elements. Build a technology center and start upgrading the shield and other areas to unlock new buildings. All right. Oh, first Officer Conway reporting in. Hello, my name is Lynn. I'm the first officer. Medical support for the injured is necessary. Set up two aid centers. Okay, so this is us right now and we are on a freaking spear. Look, this is all we got. Oh, look, there's people in here. Oh. Oh. I can go in the building. Oh, look. Where are y'all going? Where are we going? What's this? Oh, it's a little building I'm going to. Okay. Okay. So, we need a hospital. What are these? These are units repair. These are the residential units. This is a small power plant. This is the anti-gravity device, the AG devices. I'm flying, so I guess I can't scan until I'm, I'm done flying. Look at me moving though. This is really cool. I wanna see at the bottom, did, did we put, did I actually put rockets at the bottom of this shit and we're flying? Look at me. So we're hovering above Earth now or above the moon? Because the moon's what just got destroyed. We got a rescue mission. We received a signal from one of the escape pods. There are five survivors on board in need of help. Do you want to rescue them? Rescue all of them. Rescue half of them. Rescue all of them. Why would I only rescue half of them? That's so dirty. I guess maybe at a certain point it'll get too many, too much. Um. So, scan surroundings. There we go. Now that we've done flying, y'all. If I could read. So, what do y'all think of Spheres Flying Cities? How do y'all like this game so far? Oh, shoot. Go ahead and mine some water. I want to make this stronger. Why can't I? Energy necessary for... I don't have the energy. Do I not have... They don't think I have the resources I need. I gotta start mining these resources. That's what that is. Okay, so I'm mining water. So go get that. Yeah, buddy. Look at that water. Look at me on fire. Do I have anything I can build for storage? 
I would like storage. Community kitchen. Mm. Mm. Sounds interesting. Put a community kitchen down. For the community to kitchen. Mm -hmm. Um build. I need storage. Boom. Material storage. Do I have to put yep. put that down? Thanks. What else you got in here? Water storage. Uh-huh. Put that down. Thanks. What else storage? Food storage. Um. Nah, we're good for right now. I don't have much space under this green earth. So there we go. Now I got I got storage for places. I can get rid of one of these, and I'm gonna get rid of this one on the end. Um, remove. Remove it. Mm -hmm. There we go. Let's remove this. It's just floating for no reason. Remove those two things. What else is just in my way? I am the destroyer. Small tiger. Sorry, I'm I'm really stuck on watching Instagram shits. They're like in my soul now. Okay. Building broken. What building is broken? I'm tired of these buildings being broken. Stop it. What building is broke? Like, what, what? where do you see a broke building at? Repair it. It's a house. Oh, these houses is getting effed up. Oh, I see it. Oh, I see it. I see it. It's probably because of the storms and because my shield isn't that strong because we're poor. <laughs> Shite. <laughs> Shite, little baby, shite. <laughs> All right, I built your houses back. Quit your damn complaining. Hey, there's a lot of houses need repairing. These houses were made for repairing, and that's just what I'll do. But one of these days, my foot is gonna knock all over. It's because the, 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 the um, attacks here are stronger. The, the weather here is, is strong. We need to go. We need to go, baby. <laughs> oh, no, baby. What is you doing? <laughs> need to get the heck up out of here. That's what I need to do. Let me go ahead and pop up my little shits. What's here? What resources detect? What resource was it? All right, it's cool. So, that was Spheres Flying Cities. Tell me what you think in the comments and if you like the gameplay. Uh, I, I enjoyed it. I think I definitely will be playing it more. You can find Spheres Flying Cities on Steam right now, early access.